<sighs> Hi everyone and welcome to TWF uh, TWF Impact. I am Renee Young here with Quasimodo and with Aiden English. And today on Impact, we're going to see. Well, what are we going to see? Well, Quasimodo says, I want to welcome every. I want to say thank you for welcome. And welcome, Quasimodo, once again to our team. I did want to say it's great to be here in the TWF, you know, finally being on a play by play team. And I know this is. I know that this is a big deal, so. We're going to go into it. I'll tell you one thing, Aiden English says, you should take everything as a big deal. We have T-Bar in the ring right now, and he's all earnest. First off, T-Bar says, I don't care what anyone says. I want Ricochet. And I was I called Ricochet out yesterday. But Ricochet did not take me up on my dare. And I said I didn't care if I had to face him. I said I didn't care if I had to face him on impact. Which at the end of the day is no big deal to me. So where are you at, Ricochet? Are you a weakling? Because at the end of the day, if you're a weakling, then that is truly sad. I am not. So, T-Bar, is that your name you're calling yourself these days? I mean, at one time you were known as Dominic Kultabosius or Dominic Kultabosius. I can't even say your name right. But that's who you were. But now you're calling yourself T-Bar, right? And now you're, and well, as far as the WWE, I can stand up. And as far as WWE goes, I can't stand up. And as far as WWE goes, you're. And as far as WWE goes, you're teaming up with Mace. But they never made Mace's doll yet, did they? And by all means, wasn't Mace at one time? Wasn't Mace Dio Madden? Yeah, he was. So what's it to you, astronomer? Or corona, or whatever you call yourself. You can stand up without a stand. Probably right about that. That might be true. I might need a stand. That doesn't mean that I don't have, I don't have the oversight, because I need, because I need a stand to stand up in. So the way I look at it, you say that you want to fight Ricochet for the TWF Allegheny Earldom winnings, because you have this belief that you're going to be the man. And I tell you, oh, I can't stand up. And I tell you, Ecliptor says, that you don't have what it takes to take away the TWF, you know, Allegheny Earldom winnings. 
you know, from Ricochet. At least that's my belief. Eclipter says. Yeah, and whatever they said. At the end of the day, I don't think you could do shit. But then what do I know, Algar says, because my legs are crooked. Yeah, well, I do want him. And there's nothing you can do, so give me the fight. Well, let's just say, if I don't give you the fight, Astronomer says, what are you going to do if I don't give you the fight? Yeah, what are you going to do, Elgar says. If we don't give you the fight, uh, Ecliptor says, what are you going to do? He's not going to do nothing, Ricochet says, because I'll take him on right here, Astronomer. You tell me, tell him, it ain't no hang-up. I'll fight T-Bar for the TWF Pennsylvania right winnings. And I won't, and I'm no weakling. All right then, Ricochet. So today, here on Impact, we will see the TWF Pennsylvania, we'll see the TWF Allegheny Earldom winnings on the line. You know, with Ricochet, fight T-Bar. Yeah, make it a good one, Algar says. Kick T-Bar's booty. Yeah, Ricochet, you show T-Bar who's boss, Algar says. Let's make the fight go on now, Astronomer says. Oh. Well, we're going to pull it more close to the ring now. And now Renee Young said we're going to see T-Bar fight Ricochet for the TWF Pennsylvania Reich winnings here, here today on Impact. Oh no, T-Bar just beat up on Ricochet in a body slam. Ricochet getting beat up right now. Clothesline, Renee Young said. I tell you what, Quasimodo said, T-Bar, or whatever you want to call him these days, he's a very harmful man. And whoever he was back in the day, he is not that same man. But that doesn't mean to say that you shouldn't go in the ring with him without thinking he can't harm you. Because he is bold, he is strong, he has might. But I don't like him. Quasimodo says. Well, I can't think of anyone out there doesn't like him, Renee Young said. Wrestling has nothing to do with being liked or not, Aiden English says. about beating up folks and making gouge. And T-Bar seems to be truly good at both, Aiden English says. And it's going to be a big mistake that Ricochet got in the ring with T-Bar here today on Impact. Well, and now T-Bar thinks he's got everything under run here. Now he's playing around. Oh, Ricochet. Ricochet just took down T-Bar. Who thought he had everything under run. And then started, I don't know, not working on him. Ricochet. No, he's going to updo it. Ricochet's going to come from the top over there. Down on, on T-Bar. One. Two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Harry, your winner. And still, the TWF Pennsylvania right win. Oh! What well, T-Bar got ricochet. Oh! And now T-Bar, the weakling, 
who beat up Ricochet after the fight, some would see him as a weakling. You know, some would some would see him as a weakling. You know, some folks would see him as a weakling. Ah, uh, and at the end of the day, Renee Young said some would see him as a weakling. You know, after the stunt, after the stunt and Lark he pulled, and after what he did. Some would see him as the weakling. Uh, Renee Young says, Yeah, Quasimodo said, Some folks would actually say that T-Bar is a weakling because he struck Ricochet from behind after the match. You know, after the fight. So they would see him as a weakling. Wow. You can believe what you want. But at the end of the day, T-Bar got the last laugh. Yeah, Ricochet may have beaten him, but T-Bar beat him up good. He beat him up good here today on Impact. Aiden English says, And I know Jim Ross is now going to be talking. Hopefully Jim Ross, you know, hopefully Jim Ross is going to be talking with uh, T-Bar and see about his behavior. T-Bar, this ongoing hang-up, I'll tell you what, Jim Ross, I do have an ongoing hang-up. It's with Ricochet. Ricochet thinks he's the one and only. He thinks he's so great. Well, he's not. And I will not stop until I become the Pence, and I become the TWF Allegheny Earldom winner. Or Allegheny Earldom fighter. See, what I did to Ricochet... I can do to anyone. And if I get another seat to fight Ricochet, then he's mine. Well, didn't Astronema tell you that that is not the kind of behavior that she's going to put up with here in the TWF? I don't give two shits about what Astronema or Corone wants or what she'll put up with or not. I know I want to be the TWF Allegheny Earldom fighter. And Ricochet, your days are numbered. I will be the TW <coughs> I will be the TWF Pennsylvania right winner or fighter. You hear me? You shouldn't be wearing that cowboy hat anymore. <coughs> Why the fuck do you still wear the cowboy hat? Uh, well, that's uh you know T Bar. He's not he's behaving badly, Jim Ross says. Well, back to you, Renee Young. Well, thank you, Jim Ross, for talking with Dominic. Thank you for talking with T Bar here on Impact. And we'll have to know if we'll have to know <coughs> if Astronoma is going to put let Dom is going to uh, what Astronema is or is not going to put up with, Renee Young says. Well, we will, we, won't, we will not know, will we, Quasimodo said. I guess we will not, Aiden English said. Ah, but it's all the time we got here for Impact. I am Renee Young for, I'm Renee Young for Quasimodo and Aiden English. We hope you like Impact and we'll see you tomorrow.